Coheed and Cambria. Their name just sounds cool as fuck. And that is who we are going to be checking out today. The song I'm going to be doing is called Welcome Home. I think this is their biggest song. Just by their YouTube channel. Let's see what it's hitting for. But before we get to that, I do want to explain one thing. Your boy been gone for a little minute. Look, before y'all get annoyed, timestamp right there. If you do not give a fuck what I'm talking about right now, as far as where I've been, then click that and get straight into the reaction. For everybody else who's like a fan of the channel and been like, yo, where the video's been at and everything for like the last few weeks, bro. I'm not even gonna go deep into the explanation. I'm just gonna show you something real quick, bro. Okay? These videos take a good amount of time, believe it or not. As you can see, we made it a million views on Rob TV. I'm fucking broke! I'm broke! It's because I can't fucking monetize no matter what, bro. This videos to go for 400,000 views, 100,000 views, 20,000, 10,000, 50,000, all this cool ass shit. And I can't monetize it because it's music. So it's like I'm making all this content and hustling, but then I can't monetize it. So it's just fucking. It's a lot. It's hard. But I do know it's beneficial regardless. And I have a whole lot of fun doing it. And all of you guys, you know, clearly enjoy the content. So, uh, yeah, definitely got a whole lot more of this on the way. And hopefully I'm going to spin it off into other content, man. But I definitely need to make a goddamn Patreon, bro. Like, at this point, it's getting ridiculous. But let's get into the reaction. I did not think that shit was gonna start like that. <laughs> it started off fire already. A little dun, 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 like a Spanish guitar or something like that. Is that what that is? Like a Spanish guitar? And then that shit is coming here. Durr. I'm gonna bring that back a little bit. I don't even usually rewind, but that shit sound hard. Whoa! sound like a fucking boss fight bro it sounds like the, the the final villain in the movie is coming out but it's like the fight ain't start yet at this part of the, of the song it seems like it's just like a slow-mo like he walking out you know his armor and everything there's blood on a big ass fucking sword that only his strong ass can pick up he dragging it he ain't even picking the sword up it ain't up like this that shit he dragging it on the ground there's a blood stain come behind it look picture that picture what i'm saying while this beat playing listen A whore and sheep's clothing. Hey, don't cancel me, y'all. Don't cancel me. Let me get my shit off. All right. Let me get my hurt off through this song. That's, and that's what the what the art is for. Out of everything, the motherfucker came in. You could have been all I wanted with a beat like that. What the fuck she do to him? I can relate, brother. We done been through this shit, fellas. Ladies, y'all know. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't expecting his voice to sound like that. And I definitely wasn't expecting these lyrics to be like the content of the song. This shit is fucking amazing so far.
Bruh, for the love of God, who the fuck is this guitarist? And please tell me. Of course, I'll know by the time you see this video. But I'm just asking the music gods retroactively. Like you knew I was going to ask this in the future. Please tell me this dude has a fucking guitar solo on this song, bro. Because he is cooking. And the drummer is fire. The guitarist is amazing. The drummer is fucking cooking. And the singer's voice and lyrics. Chef's kiss. This shit is hard as fuck. Like it's kind of sad. Like listening to the lyrics. Like if you could, if you can relate to this shit, which I'm assuming everybody here listening to this is an adult. Either you an adult, or you so you can definitely relate, and you've been through some shit, some relationship shit, or you a goddamn teenager in high school with a little breakup, and you think you can relate to this shit, even though you really can't. I know I sound like the old motherfucker. I remember I used to think people was tripping, but yeah, you can't really relate to this shit yet, but I'm sure it sounds good to you too. It's kind of sad, but the song hype as fuck too. It's weird. Like, usually a breakup song or, you know, is like more mellow and dramatic. This shit is like, uh-uh, this shit is like, it's high energy. It's like the chaos from the pain he's feeling is coming out or the, the whole band or whatever. This shit is fucking fire. <laughs> Had to bring it back to let the let the it look like they're going into the solo. It'd be like a switch up. So I don't know if, if you watch this with headphones right now or if you just have heard the song with headphones. But like one of the dope ass things is this panning. Like you'll hear certain stuff only in your left ear and then it'll stop there and transition it and they have to do a little switch up and it's only in the right ear. And then even in general, I know y'all can hear that little switch up they did now where it's like a little deeper. I don't know if that's like the bass they just switched to or something. But fuck that that whole that whole ensemble just sounds. Look at me ensemble. Look at me. A professional, official, goddamn, I think this makes me an official music critic because I hit record and, and say silly shit. So I can say ensemble. Y'all shouldn't try that at home. Tell me this ain't final boss music, bro. <laughs>
Imagine if that just dropped this. <laughs> Is that a violin or something? <laughs> Yo, no, the little switch up to like the switch up to only having the chords at the end was fire as fuck. That was sick. That was sick. I need to hear a whole. I just need to hear a whole Coed and Cambria uh, album. So uh, my overall reaction to that song, for one, I would just give it like a whew, damn. I hate giving out like super high scores uh, to songs to so many. Well, I guess to be fair, I do be saying that when a song be trash, I do be saying it's trash. So I'm not going to just lie and penalize it for the fact that I, 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 I start to feel like I like too many songs or some shit like that. But anyway, this song right here is like, I don't know, maybe at least a 9.5. I was like a 9.5 out of 10. Um, fucking amazing. The intro was crazy as hell. Um, I love the fact that the lyrics was surprising to me because I would not have at all expected. It was called Welcome Home. Why is it called Welcome Home? It's like Welcome to the Grave of like the, because he's talking about a whole lot of like the death of the relationship and stuff like that or the death of. I don't want it to sound crazy, but like the death of his idea of this partner that he's no longer with or something like that. So I'm not sure exactly why it's called like Welcome Home exactly. Um, but the shit is fucking fire, bro. The lyrics was crazy. I was not expecting to be like a breakup song. Um, the vibe was wild. And again, I can't, maybe it's just a gamer in me, bro, but like I can't stress how much it feels like final boss music, whether it's in a video game or like just the, the the dude at the end of the movie that's like the big bad guy like i feel like i don't know somebody who would, who would walk out at the end of this fuck damn i'm trying to think of a specific situation maybe fucking Sephir sephiroth from uh from final fantasy 7 maybe sephiroth could have came out to this fucking music or something like that which is a super huge compliment so shout out to coe to cambria y'all made a goddamn banger make sure y'all subscribe to the channel like subscribe follow me on twitter instagram and all that i got this reaction like the reason i did this reaction is because of it was in the suggestions and whatnot so please continue to put that stuff in the comment section and let me know what y'all think about these videos and i am gonna up the output but for anybody who did not watch it earlier in the video it's rough bro I can't monetize these videos, bruh. I did a Patreon or something. or Maybe I should start a YouTube join button. Some way for people to fuck with the videos to support your boy if they, if you so choose. But yeah. Anyway, I love making these. Got a whole lot more on the way. I'll be your boy Rob TV. And I'm out.